How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you today. As always, hope you're all having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. Today's episode is a very special episode because we're going to be showcasing the top five winners from my strikeout theme contest that we were holding in my Discord server this last week. Now, if you didn't see the contest or you would like to participate in the next contest, which right now we have an art contest going on, uh, be sure to click on the link in the description of the video to join my Discord server, The Sword Cord. So, I asked you guys to come up with your best strikeout teams uh, in the last contest, and you guys voted for the top five winners. And so, we're going to show those five teams in this video, starting with number five. Number five winning strikeout theme was Ampers, the last alliance of elves and men, and also dwarves. And he sh he's showing them in uh, classic colors, but you can't use uh, classic colors in strikeout for some reason. But I really, really enjoy this uh, theme. This is a very creative one. I have not seen a theme that is like this before, and people have been giving me video ideas for a long time. So... We have all three of these skins. We have the Dragonport Olgrim, we have King Roland, and finishing out this alliance of elves and men and dwarves is, of course, Grove Warden Ember. Oops, where did it go? There we go. Whoa. Oops, I think I did random like colors. Yeah, we're. Oh, I could do black, but now nah, we're just going to do community colors on this one. I think it looks the most natural. And yeah, if uh, if it if it comes down to it, and it looks like I'm gonna three stock with Olgram or something, I'll just go ahead and KO myself. That way, we can look at the other characters at least on the team. All right, I want to play at least one match with with each of these winning teams. But yeah, I really really like this squad just because it has a Lord of the Rings vibe. I thought that was really cool. All right, we're going against Swiggity Swaggity Megity Sweeven. Oops, my taunt didn't work. There we go. Get down there! Alright, this guy's actually a diamond, and he's pretty good, so I don't think I have to kill myself. He should be able to get rid of my Ogrim by himself. There we go. There we go. Come on, Queen Nah. You want to get through this alliance? You're going to have to actually kill me. Man, take that chainsaw to the face, Queen Nye. Nah. Alright, she needs a little bit of help. So I'm gonna just KO myself so we can look at more of this team. We got King Roland here representing the human race. Oh, okay. She's not bad with her axe. But still, I got two stocks. What? Actually, that might have killed her. Oh man, we didn't even get to play as Ember. Feels bad. Player one wins. That's what I was worried about. But still, awesome strikeout team. I really appreciate that one, Amper. Very good job. Thank you for submitting uh, that idea into the contest. At number four, we have Gigabyte Dragons. I'm sorry, Gigabyte Dragons. Bamboo Hat Boys with community colors. This one is really funny as well. I can't believe I never thought of this myself because I have played a lot of Brawlhalla, but we have uh, Nightblade Hattori. We have Koji with the... Uh, where's my Koji? I always forget. Okay, there he is. We have Koji with the bamboo hat as well. We have Ronin Koji. And then we have Wushong. Seeker Wushong. Community colors. 
again is what he picked. All three of these guys have bamboo hats, I think, which is pretty awesome. Very cool skin. Very cool theme for a strikeout video as well. I can see why this got number four. A little bit disappointed the last Alliance of Elves and Men didn't get higher. That one was honestly one of my favorites. But be sure to watch to the end, guys, because you're going to want to see what the last couple teams are. They are very, very cool teams. All right, going against Rimage. We got Orion, Dusk, and Ada on his team. Hopefully, we'll get to go through all three legends on my team here. Even if I have to give him a little bit of uh, assistance on that. We got the the cone hat. Okay, he, he, I was trying to let him get a weapon, but I guess he doesn't want it. He, he's going unarmed. Yeah, if he keeps this up, he's definitely going to need some help. Oh boy. Orion. Oh, he came right up just enough. All right, yeah. Thank you, Hattori, for your service. Next up, we have Ronin Koji. Oh, man. He could have dodged back. Alright, thank you Koji for your service. <laughs> now we have Seeker Wushan. And that'll do it. Wow. I didn't think that would actually kill him, but I feel like he doesn't know how to dodge. He wasn't dodging to get back. He wasn't doing it as a recovery option. Anyways, GG dude, GG. All right, at number three, guys, we have Wendell's Amigos. Actually, for this, uh, for this theme, I might actually have to go into the store. Yeah, I don't have a couple of these skins. You're making me spend money for these skins. Which I appreciate, because honestly, I was thinking about getting these two anyways. So, be right back while I uh, get some funds, because I don't have enough to buy these. <laughs> okay, we have Mammoth Coins. Let's go ahead and purchase Morto Azoth, and I just purchased the uh, Lady of the Dead Nye. So now I think I can do this strikeout team. That is number three. This is a top three strikeout team. So we have we have the Azoth skin. This is one that I actually have never used before. We have Morito Azoth. I could be saying these wrong, so forgive me. We got. Calavera Cassidy. I really like this Cassidy. one, actually. And then we have the Queen Nye. Lady of the Dead Queen Nye. And he said, uh... It looks like haunting colors. So, we'll do that. Queen Nye. Thank you, uh, Wendell. This is a very cool theme. Honestly, though, I've been wanting to do this theme, like, in a video by itself for a long time. I've just been kind of saving it in the back of my head, so it's really cool that one of you guys actually thought of it as well, and that it got voted uh, highly, so that is really cool. Thank you for doing that, man. And thank you for you guys for voting for it. By the way, guys, if you would like to participate in the next contest, we have one going on right now. Uh, the one that we have going on right now is an art contest. 
So if you feel like you can uh, make some cool Brahalla art and you want to win community colors or have your art shown in one of my future videos, go ahead and join that contest. Um, all right, so this map looks really dark because I installed a mod for the night version and I didn't know it would be this dark just because it was the night version, so... I apologize for that. I meant to fix it after yesterday's stream and I just forgot. Alright, I'm actually just gonna kill myself just so that we can go through the stocks. Alright, thank you for your service, Azoth. My blasters are a little bit rusty right now. You going for that weapon, boy? Killing myself so we can get to Queen Nai and have an epic final stock showdown. Oh, man. I would just love to hit with that side pick. Boom! Right off the edge. If they pop their head open over that little edge, boom! Side sig, dead. Queen Eye has such powerful sigs. Awesome theme, Wendell, thank you for that. And now guys, we are into the top two theme strikeout winners. At number two, we have Souls, Tea Enthusiast. <laughs> This one is great. We have Wushong again. We have uh, Gentleman Wushong, I believe. Yes. We have uh, Caspian. We have Gentleman Caspian. Oh, sorry, Aces High Caspian. And we have Cross, which is really cool because I don't get to use Cross too often. We have Double Cross. And then this one, he also had Haunting Colors um, or Lucky Clover. So we just did haunting in the last one, so I'm going to use Lucky Clover. I like that he gave us that second option to use Lucky Clover. Thank you, Soul, for this tea enthusiast theme strikeout. This one is especially close to my heart because I drink tea every day pretty much, and I love tea. So awesome, awesome strikeout theme team right here. We even have a uh, room in our Discord server just for tea enthusiasts. So if you also enjoy tea, definitely join the Discord server. Going against Ramage again. Azoth, Cassidy, and Cross this time on his team. Three, two, one, oh man, this tea enthusiast team is so great. Definitely a top three team. It's actually number two, but I, I, I knew right away it would be a top three team. Bye, dude. All right, Wushong, thank you for your service. <laughs> Let's keep it going. Uh, we have Caspian. I've been I've been playing Caspian a bit. All right, Caspian, thank you for your service. Sorry, I'm not getting to use them a whole lot, guys. But for some reason, I'm not getting matched against diamonds right now. I did the one time. Usually when I do strikeout, it's it's pretty good, but for some reason getting matched against newer players, nothing wrong with that, but makes for a short game. Reading that dodge away. Just realized this is cross versus cross. GG dude, GG. Kind of figured he would go up for that platform, so I just waited and then did the neutral sig. Alright guys, we've come down to it. Last but not least, the strikeout team rated by you guys to be the number one themed strikeout team is 
X Nightmare XKBC's Time Wreckers. We have Future Spirit Artemis. Artemis. We have. Oh man. We have Caspian. No, that's Lucian. We have Plague Doctor Lucian. Lucian. And last but not least, we have. Ramesses Rayman. And he. <laughs> I said, oh man, because. He has them in black colors, and I just don't have Rayman to level 25 yet. I have the other two. Rayman's level 20. Um, but as a secondary option, he he said uh, home team color, so we're going to go with that. I do have that. Uh, definitely working on getting Rayman black. Yes! Let's do it, guys. This is the number one voted strikeout team, as voted by, by you guys. Definitely let me know in the comments which team was your favorite. And if you want to see a lot more teams that were really, really good teams but didn't make it into the top five, because there was literally dozens and dozens of teams. Uh, just Actually, I don't know if the room is still there in the Discord server. I'm going to have to ask Bob about that. But um, in the future, if you want to vote and see all the other options that don't make it into the video, definitely join the Discord server. There's already a ton of good art that is being submitted for the art contest, so I can't wait to check that out. Oh man, that Lance side sig is amazing. I even get to use the site. All right, no problem. Thank you for your service, Artemis. All right, we got Plague Dr. Lucian. The Time Wreckers. Interesting theme here. I love bouncing them around like that with the guitars. Oh, if I would have waited, I could have got that slap. Oh, I can't hit it. Oh my goodness. There, I'll just do recovery. All right, last but not least, we have Rayman. He actually made it into a video. I haven't played Rayman in a while. <laughs> he kind of killed himself, but I bomped him on the head just to finish it. Oh man, would have been nice if we could have had a little bit better games, but hey, it is what it is. Um, I definitely want to thank everybody who submitted a uh, entry into this contest whether you made it into the video or not. I also especially want to thank Bob the Builder for being an awesome event manager and I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed please drop a like, be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content and definitely join my discord server if you want to be involved in future contests or just to hang out with you know chill people. So <laughs> with that guys this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, guys.